All right, so today I want to show you a little something that I learned over the weekend. Um, I'm working on a cutting board, a custom cutting board right now for uh, a client, and they are a graphic designer, and they sent me this SVG file to use. And um, when I went to go import it, uh, it, it just was coming out weird and there were a few things about it that um, I didn't like and uh, one of them being um, as you can see um, all of these little objects that they used to create this vine are separate objects um, and what I did I figured out how to connect them to where it makes one solid line so that basically the reef is an outline now and not a bunch of separate objects. And so I'm going to show you today um, in Inkscape, uh, which is a free program. This is how I figured out how to connect all these little individual objects into one in order to make them uh, cuttable on the shaper. First thing you got to do is um, this is actually grouped as one object. You have to ungroup this first. So. Now that I've ungrouped it, you've got two objects, and then you've got to go into each individual object and ungroup them again. And you got to continue to ungroup all the way down until you get every single object as a single object. And I noticed in this process, um, I started trying to use the union function in Inkscape a little bit too quickly here. And once I realized um, that not everything was, um, ungrouped uh, I had to go through and, and ungroup so I'm gonna fast forward through this part but basically what you've got to do is go through and check every little object and make sure that nothing is still in a group uh, because when you're using the union function you've got to make sure that everything is is its own individual piece and then you're gonna go through and select each of those individual pieces in order to unify them uh, and bring them together uh, to make that one outline that you're looking for. Um, <clears throat> and as I was doing this process, I also realized um, I needed to zoom in um, because I couldn't quite select each individual piece being so zoomed out. So once I zoomed in uh, and realized now I can can hit each individual piece, uh, and basically what you do is you, you have to, to hold shift down. So you're holding the shift key down and you're just selecting each piece and then you're going up to the drop down um, and you're you're hitting union so you're holding down shift you're going up you're dropping down and uh, hitting union and as you do that you can see these pieces are coming together and it's it's bringing them all into one piece and leaving you with just the outline not all of these little individual pieces and so I kind of sped this up so you can see this process uh, but again once you're done and uh, here's another one that I did not have ungrouped that I needed to ungroup. And now that I've ungrouped it, I can go in and select all the pieces and go up to your drop down and select union. And then when you're done, as you can see, it's all one line that you can now export to an SVG and, uh, and then you're able to cut that much much better on the shaper so i hope this was helpful uh, leave some comments feedback and subscribe keep watching thanks so much